Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at a new reflex optic from Shield Sights. Shield has been making optics for years. A lot of people trust them. They own the RMS footprint that has been copied by so many other optic producers. But they received feedback from their customers and they said, there's one thing specific that we want from your optics that you don't offer. And here's what it is. This is an RMSC. It has the battery underneath the optic. To replace the battery, you have to pull off the optic and swap out the battery that way. And that also requires reciting in the optic because unless you have the perfect torque with those screws, you'll have to recite it in, at least touch it up a bit. Not so much with this model. Now here it is, it's called the RMSD. And if you go with this, it'll come with the optic itself this nifty rubber cover, cover plate, a hex wrench for mounting, a wrench for sighting in, an optional plate, four screws, and a mini dial. But I'm going to keep this mounting wrench out because this is the very tool needed to access the RMSD. What does the D stand for? The D stands for drawer. There it is. Now notice it does not have a screw that you unscrew to take out that battery compartment. See, it's absent of that screw. I've never seen an optic have a battery swap quite like this. A little bit about the optic first. It is aluminum housed. It has a hard dip coated acrylic lens which Shield Sight says that it is 10 times stronger with impact than glass. I like the way they have that cutout right there where you can access your, your front sight. You get a clear picture with the front sight. That helps with sighting in. And it is auto brightness. So in heavier light conditions, or shall I say brighter light conditions, the dot will illuminate a little more. Low light conditions, it'll dim down. It has night vision. And this is available with four MOA red dot or eight MOA red dot. This is a four MOA red dot and I have it mounted on my Hellcat Pro threaded. I think this is a, a fine handgun and the combination is, is very nice. So how do you operate the door? Well, it has this hole on the left side. See that right there? All you're going to do is take this wrench and push it through and that will push out the door. Have you ever seen anything like this? I haven't. And I have a lot of pistols with red dots. From there, all you do, take out the 1632 battery, swap it out, throw it right back in there, and you don't have to remove the optic from the pistol, which is a super cool thing that they did in the way they did that. Because the screws, that's fine, it works. But yeah, you have to get the little screwdriver. This, you literally could swap out the optic in seconds. So I mounted it on with a direct mount, by the way, on the Hellcat Pro threaded. Took it to the range. Let's see how this thing works. As I mentioned, this is a new site. It is on their site. You can look at it, but they don't have an MSRP yet. It says it will be available soon. We're really not sure when it will be available or the MSRP. So I was able to get my hands on this, test it out. I didn't drop it or drag it behind a car or anything. I just wanted to see how well that operated. The whole concept is kind of cool without the screw there. I'll just push it push the wrench through and open up that drawer or side loading battery compartment <laughs> but drawer is just easier to say and swap out the battery the dot is clear as can be can't see it on camera you can, these things never pick up on camera as hard as you try they just don't do it but the dot is clear the hard dipped coated acrylic lens is cool you won't necessarily notice with 
the acrylic lens compared to glass, you're, you're not going to say, oh, that's an acrylic lens. It's clear that it is. You won't notice that, but perhaps being that it's 10 times stronger, if you drop your gun, you may notice, especially a hard drop. But anyways, it has all the makings that people love about Shield with the RMS footprint and everything. So many pistols available with that, or they offer optic plates available with the RMS footprint. But so far, I'm happy with it. I, I have other Shield sights. They're fine. What would I like from Shield? I would like Shake Awake. This is not Shake Awake. The average battery life in dark conditions is two years. The good news is you don't have to remove the optic to swap out the battery. That's the draw here. It's called the Shield RMSD. Available soon. Hopefully, you, you like it and check it out. And I'm hoping they price it well so a lot of people can enjoy the benefits of quick and easy battery swaps with a quality optic from Shield Sights. I certainly enjoy it. I found it a very easy sight in at the range. Barely touched it. So it comes out of the box pretty well sighted in for probably just a compact size pistol like this. Minor adjustments. I got it on target. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.